Welcome back everyone. You may be having an issue with your Xbox Series X or S where for some reason the console just keeps crashing or it just keeps freezing and you're trying to figure out what the problem is. Now the first thing I'd recommend doing is to actually see if you actually recently did anything to your Xbox out of the ordinary. Did you recently update it? Did you recently drop it? Did you kick it really hard or something like that? If anything like that that you do out of the ordinary happened, well that may be an issue. So what I would recommend doing is to actually unplug your Xbox, letting it sit there for a couple of minutes and plugging it back in and seeing if the problem persists. Sometimes even a drop or something like that can cause some issues, but I will be honest, sometimes, you know, things just click into place randomly. Sometimes things just happen and you may actually be able to fix it from there. Now, if you boot up your Xbox and everything is perfectly fine, then there's probably not an issue. However, if you did actually end up causing some physical damage to it, you may want to just inspect your Xbox as you know smoothly as possible. And you may just want to make sure there's not any issues. If there are, then there may be nothing you can do. You may just have to go ahead and actually update your Xbox. In my opinion, that is pretty much the most important thing you can do. So make your way over to your Xbox settings. You want to go ahead and actually update the console itself under your system settings and then you want to see if the problem persists. If the problem is still persisting, you may have to go ahead and actually send your specific console into Microsoft and have them take a look at your console. Because like I mentioned, if there's physical damage to the console, there's really not much you can do. However, if everything was perfectly fine and you've done nothing to your Xbox and it's just something that's completely random, well, what you can do and what I've seen people do again and again is to actually go ahead and reinstall the games that you're actually trying to play. So I not all the time is it crashing on the home menu, probably it's crashing when you're in a game or it's freezing when you're in a game. So what I would recommend doing is seeing if there's any updates available for that specific game. That's something that I've kind of seen and I've kind of done with my PlayStation 4 and I've done with my Xbox One. I've not experienced any crashes on my series yet, but if you are experiencing those, trying to go ahead and actually update those games under your Xbox store may be something you can do. You can also try reinstalling those games as well. That's something that I've done for a couple of years now, is just deleting the game and reinstalling it. If you're lucky, your save data will probably still be there. However, just be wary that if you don't back up your console, if there's no backup of your games or anything, then you're probably going to lose your data in that game. And reinstalling it is probably one of the only ways to go about doing it. Now, if you're playing an online game, things like you know Fortnite or any other online game, you're probably going to have to go ahead and make sure you have a solid network connection. If you have a very weak internet connection, that could probably be an issue. So simply just going through and actually connecting to a better network connection can probably fix it for you. And that's probably all you have to do to be honest. If you guys have any other questions or anything like that, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, not me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.